Welcome to the newsletter. Russia launched a missile attack on a Ukrainian defense industrial facility. On Channel HT New the Russian military has attacked an engine assembly and fighter aircraft maintenance plant in southern Ukraine. In a statement released on November 19, Boris Rogov, a pro-Russian official in the Zaporizhia region in southern Ukraine, said that the Russian military had carried out numerous missile strikes on its military facilities. Ukraine within the last 24 hours. According to Rogov, the Russian military attacks have caused heavy damage to the Ukrainian army when a large ammunition depot, as well as a factory that assembles engines and repairs fighter aircraft, was severely damaged. An ammunition and weapons depot in the Shevchenkovsky district and an aircraft manufacturing and maintenance plant of the Motor Sik Corporation were hit and exploded, Rogov said confirming that the factory that was attacked was the site of production. Manufactures AI-450 aircraft engines, unmanned aerial vehicles, and provides maintenance and repair services for Ukrainian military aircraft. In recent times, the Russian military has continuously organized raids against targets in southern Ukraine. In a statement issued on November 18, the head of the military administration of the Dnipropetrovska region of Ukraine Valentin Reznichenko accused the Russian army of conducting heavy artillery shelling on many targets in the city of Nikopol during the night of 17 and early morning. November 18. Many areas of Nikopol were attacked by Russian artillery. Enemy multiple rocket launchers launched more than 40 attacks overnight. Many buildings were damaged. Power lines were also hit. Russian shells also caused serious damage to a motor vehicle repair facility in a solar power plant in Nikopol. Many people's vehicles were destroyed, said Mr. Reznichenko, at the same time. Confirmed the attack left no human consequences. According to observers, the raids were in response to the withdrawal of Russian troops from the strategic city of Kherson. According to preliminary statistics, the cost that Russia has to spend to conduct raids in recent days can be up to US$1 billion. United States. Earlier, on November 12, the spokesman of the Ukrainian Air Force Yuri Iinet warned that the Russian military would conduct a large-scale attack on many targets in Ukraine when many missiles and rockets have been moved. Transferred from Belarus to Moscow bases in the Donbass region. Many major events are about to take place, including the G20 summit. The Russian military is likely to launch large-scale attacks on this occasion, Inet said. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to the channel, share to support and update the latest videos from HT News Channel.